Hello, and welcome back once again to some more Outer Wilds. And we're, we're, we're still in the sh sick stream, everybody. We're still sick. I'm recording this while under the weather. Oh, wait, I have the wrong keyboard on my lap. Fuck. Eh. Ah, shit. Yeah. Okay. Ugh, hold on. Let me adjust myself a little. It's, uh, been a, it's been a few moments. I had taken a break, but we're back now. So, when we left off, we were sort of... I wonder if I look down and up enough, will the quantum moon start orbiting that planet? <laughs> Let's go to our ship and figure out what we're, going, what we're doing next. Last time I just wanted to sort of follow one of the escape pods. I, I was debating if I was going to do that again or if I was going to go and start trying to investigate some of the mysteries. Um... I think... Alright, let's see here, so... Yeah, okay. Yeah, the quantum moon. I think I want to go and start exploring Ember Twin some more. Negative time interval measured. Yeah, the, the Ember Twin's equator. I know very little about Ash Twin. Let's go back to Ember Twin again, explore them again. Oh, there's the quantum moon. And it's equator is where the the project is, huh? God, just hang on. Sync up with it. Fuck. Stop orbiting it. Yeah, we learned about the high energy lab being here at the equator, apparently, and I wanna... Oh god. Oh god. Okay, maybe this was a mistake. Jesus Christ. What does it mean by at the equator? Hold on. The equator is this, right? Oh, you know, maybe it was the building that we had seen in the viewing pool last time, which was... ...on the edge of the equator. This place. Is this the high energy lab? Yeah, this is where we saw with the last the viewing pool la pool last time. Remember? So the question is, how do we get down there? Oh, probably with this. Hmm. 
Let's follow this. Oh, Jesus. Oh, come on. Crash site caves. Sunless city. Fucking ghost matter. I wonder if my ship can pass through ghost matter safely. Hey, Quantum Moon. Ooh, ooh, hold on, there's a door right here. Oh, that's terrifying. Sunless City. Note, this door will need to remain closed for some time. Pi and I are running experiments based on extraordinary findings of the White Hole Station. Roma and I will be running this experiment until what? God, that's so annoying. Experiment until one of us, specifically me, can prove the other wrong. So although it is inconvenient, the lab currently has can only be accessed from the path from the Sunless City. Investigating the inside would disrupt the steps, or the setup, and could have enormous consequences. We realize this is an intriguing prospect, but the door must remain closed nonetheless. An update. The High Energy Lab is now being used to design the Ash Twins project. If you're here to help, or even uh, to observe, be sure to use the Sunless City path into the lab. High Energy Lab. Oh, come on. Alright, I guess let's go into the city and try and find a way to the high energy lab from in there. There it is. This is my shortcut in. All right, ready? Oh, no, 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 no. Shit me. Stupid fucking jet. I hate this jet pet. It never works how I want it to work. No, you're kidding me. I hate this jetpack so much. Activate the booster! Jesus. Oh, let's go back down. Alright, now. There we go. So how do I get to the high energy lab? All right, so turn off everything except the trailhead. Is it over here? I don't get it. Oh, 
Oh, am I too late? Has the path already been buried? You're kidding me. Well, that sucks. Alright, let's just get up and out of here then. There's nothing else we can do here. You have to get down here immediately in order to take that path. Whoa, oh fuck, wait, what's that down? That's just the path to here. Right, careful. Yeah. Alright, so where are we going instead if we can't do that? I think if we can't do that, I instead want to go and explore Brittle Hollow again. Let's get a little bit of an orbit around Brittle Hollow. Look at what's going on with it on the inside, on the surface. What is that dome there? I want to land near that dome and see what that is about. I'm here! I did it! The ship is down safely! Um, in that ship, uh, in that the ship went down, and I didn't sustain bodily harm. A few minor repairs, and it looks uh, like the ship never even, was never even hit by those rocks. One of my better attempts. Fieldsparrow would barely have laughed at me, I bet. That's the good news. The bad news? I, uh, haven't found a way inside this structure yet. The door is broken. I know I'm not great at exploring, but I think I should have found a different entrance by now if I were one, p probably. I can't get inside from here, but I know there are paths below the surface. I'm going to head north to the ruins on the equator and try to find a way down. Hmm. Oh, and there's his ship right, uh, right next to mine. Ow. His ship is closer in design to mine, I think. A little different still. But closer. Than some of the others, that is. I landed on his ship, that's funny. Yeah. Ow. Oh god. Activate the jet boost with you fucking worthless jet booster shits. Never activating when I need them to.
Okay. Let's float through here. Let's turn on the spin. Uh, uh all right, it's this. Oh, I looked right around. Come on. Just get lined right up. Here's the comet. There it is. We're moving in. And. Shaboo. God, I feel like we're already losing time. Let's go down to those walkways. Ow. It's gotta be somewhere around here. I wanna find the guy here. Oh, hold on, what's this about? Deeply unpleasant. I made it this far, though. Guess that's the uh, part to focus on. Not how I'll eventually have to get back up that path. But now this place sure is something. It looks like a ha the Hang City is north from here. And east is the Gravity Cannon. Definitely want to see that. And another thing. I'm detecting oxygen from below. Hmm. Hang City, Gravity Cannon. Okay, so from the gravity cannon, I can get to the iceberg area. Now, how do I get below to where he is? Oh, oh. I walk around, okay. Am I near him? Oh my goodness, there he is. No first aid kit, buddy? Oh, look at him. Oh, you launched. That's great. Great job, you. Wow, I guess that means uh, I've been out here a while, huh? Well, um, this is Brittle Hollow, but you probably knew that. A lot of history here. It's great. Are you not, like, panicked? What are you doing here? I'm here to see the Hanging City. It's always been my dream to see it with my own four eyes, ever since I was a hatchling. An alien race lived in this solar system long before our species even existed. How could I not want to see what their civilization was like? Only... You've probably heard the others say it, right? I'm afraid of space. Seriously. I'm more surprised than anyone I, uh, anyone that I'm out here. You do want to, to or do you want to know how I even got this far? I fell. I tripped over a gravity crystal. It's dumb luck. I landed somewhere. My little scout says that it's halfway stable instead of being sucked into what's below. I've been gauging the stability of the ground around uh, me using the little scout, and this seems to be a be the place with the best surface integrity. So I'm just going to stay here until I'm ready to move on. But that's enough about about me and my problems. 
You didn't come all the way to listen to me blather, did you? Heh, <laughs> that'd be... yeah. What should I explore here? Oh, wow, where shouldn't you explore here? Um, not the black hole, actually. That's very... no. Which is unfortunate, because, uh, I'm most excited- the most exciting stuff is all below the crust, including the Hanging City. That's just uh, to the north. You can uh, see it from here. There's also a big dome on the south called the Southern Observatory. You can't get inside the, from the surface. Trust me, I tried. But, he, but if it's like the rest of the Nomai structures here, there's probably a path beneath the, sur the crust somewhere. Good luck with exploring. Um, if you learn anything about the Nomai, I'd love to hear it. If it's not too much trouble. I learned something. Oh cool, what is it? I found a Nomai escape pod on Brittle Hollow. Oh wow, the Nomai probably came here from somewhere outside the solar system. And they must have uh, been in trouble when they launched their escape pod. But what kind of trouble? And where did the escape pod launch from? I'm so curious. This is an amazing discovery. I hope we can find out more about uh, how and why uh, the Nomai li arrived here. I saw an old settlement. Isn't it amazing? Hard to believe the settlement uh, is still standing, but there it is. It really makes you appreciate living somewhere in like timble timber hearth. You know, somewhere that isn't being constantly bombarded with meteorites and rocks and stuff. Uh, I saw the Hanging City on Br Brittle Hollow. You visited the Hanging City? Oh gosh, how was it? Was it amazing? Was it beautiful? Was it scary? The Hanging City is where the Nomai settled permanently on Brittle Hollow. But no, it was uh, their, mo it was their most advanced settlement here. Why they chose to build their most advanced settlement so close to, uh, you know, what's behind me. Maybe that kind of uh, makes sense uh, to a Nomai, though... Maybe they needed uh, the black hole for something. I saw the sunless city on the Ember Twin. You mean there's another Nomai city inside of Ember Twin? That's incredible. A whole city, and I had no idea it existed. That's great. How did they keep the sand out? If, there, if it were me, I'd be nervous about getting buried in the caves by that awful river of sand. Gosh, the nearby server no my sure were ingenu ingenious building an entire settlement underground. The Sunless City. Wow. That means there are two groups of Nomai, one that lived on Ember Twin and one that lived here on Brittle Hollow. But they must have uh, traveled around the solar system since Nomai writing can be found all uh, found on other planets too. Uh, I found writings about a quantum pilgrimage. Or uh, yeah. Blue. The quantum pilgrimage to the quantum moon. The Nomai mentioned the quantum moon in a lot of writing, so it's clearly special to them. And, um, special enough to make a trip there to by themselves. It seems like a coming of age ritual. Like how the hatchings stay hatchlings until their stomachs uh, are strong enough to drink wa s the sap wine. I guess I went through their coming of age ritual, huh? Maybe once I know my journey to the quantum moon, they were considered an adult. I talked to a living Nomai. Ah, that doesn't make any sense. I don't understand. I'm very excited for you, though. Please, stop yelling. What? On the Quantum Moon? You said there's a sort of living Nomai on the Quantum Moon? Why did you say so? Oh, wow, wow. This is the best thing that's ever happened in the history of Outer Wilds Ventures. I can't believe you talked to an actual Nomai. Great. So I just have to go back into space, fly to the quantum moon with zero visibility, find a spooky ruin, and travel through a few different types of dangerous terrain to get there. Okay, yeah, that's not so bad. That's probably doable. Well, I guess that's it for us now. It was good talking with you, buddy.
Real feels like that journey flew right by. Next time, I think we're gonna go and try and explore that lab on the Ember Twin. Get there fast enough and see it. I'll see all you then.